managerial economics managerial economics is the application of the economic concepts and economic analysis to the problems of formulating rational managerial decisions it is sometimes referred to as business economics and is a branch of economics that applies microeconomic analysis to decision methods of businesses or other management units as such it bridges economic theory and economics in practice it draws heavily from quantitative techniques such as regression analysis correlation and calculus if there is a unifying theme that runs through most of managerial economics it is the attempt to optimize business decisions given the firm's objectives and given constraints imposed by scarcity for example through the use of operations research mathematical programming game theory for strategic decisions and other computational methods managerial decision areas include assessment of investable funds selecting business area choice of product determining optimum output determining price of product determining input combination and technology sales promotion almost any business decision can be analyzed with managerial economic techniques but it is most commonly applied to risk analysis production analysis pricing analysis capital budgeting At universities, the subject is taught primarily to advanced undergraduates and graduate business schools. It is approached as an integration subject. It integrates many concepts from a wide variety of prerequisite courses. In many countries, it is possible to read for a degree in business economics, which often covers managerial economics, financial economics, game theory, business forecasting, and industrial economics. Managerial economics to a certain degree is prescriptive in nature as it suggests course of action to a managerial problem. Problems can be related to various departments in a firm like production, accounts, sales. Number one, demand decision. Two, production decision. Three, theory of exchange or price theory. Four, all human economic activity. Demand refers to the willingness to buy a commodity. And demand here defines the market size for a commodity. Who will buy the commodity? Analysis of the demand is important for a firm as its revenue, profits, income of the employees depend on it. Demand willingness, excuse me, demand greater willingness and, and being able to purchase. We have the will and power to purchase anything is demand. Read about de demand decision. The definition is not very clear here. Read also about business economics, personal economics, management science. Read all about managerial economics. Managerial economics. Managerial economics.